Hey, Caitlin Ross is on the campaign trail and is live this evening in Tampa. Caitlin. Shannon, we're live on the USF campus, and you're right about one thing. Things are certainly heating up here in Florida. The debate's going to be held right behind me. You can see they have it really barricaded off. A number of students kind of walking around the campus right now, but they do have a specific assigned place on campus. Follow me in here. They've set up a watch party inside this tent. They have about 300 seats set up, surround sound, also a big screen TV so everyone can watch hopefully in peace. There have been a number of protesters out and about at the different events. So far, no protesters here today, but at the different campaign stops that these candidates are going to, people haven't been shy about speaking up. So when, when, when you look at... <laughs> I'm not a ring concern. Did you, did you know Ronald Reagan? No, actually, these are the people. These are the people. You're the eruptors. And Mitt and New aren't the only two who have been attacked. Rick Santorum actually got a glitter bomb thrown in his face at a campaign stop yesterday. And as far as Ron Paul goes, he hasn't been actively campaigning in Florida, so no real opportunity for any protesters there yet. But there are a number of his signs here on campus. Reporting live in Tampa, Caitlin Ross, First Coast News.